All right, so just to continue um, with the second part of this lesson, I want you to write the word lock. Lock. And remember, if it's a short vowel, it's a CK. If it's a long vowel, an A, an E, an I, an O, a U, an U, it goes here with KE. All right, and then this K is something different. So, short vowel or long vowel? Lock. And remember how you break that down? L. A. Is that vowel you hear, that aw sound, long or short? Look, awk, lock. Okay, it is a short sound, so it goes over here. If it was a long sound, it would be loke. Okay, so short sounds just have a CK on the end. Okay, lock. How about duck? Duck. Okay, there was a duck in the pond. So that sound that you hear, is it long or is it short? Okay. D, a. Ah. Okay, if it's not an A, an E, an I, an O, a U, or a N, it's short. Okay. D, a. Ah. So it's a. Ah. Okay. Duck. It's short. Short sound. Okay, if it was long, it would be duke. Alright. Next, I want you to write lick. Lick. You might lick your ice cream. So what do you hear? Short or long in there? Okay. Look. It. What do you hear? Okay. You should hear an I sound, which is short. Lick. Okay, look, if it's a long sound, you get like. Just like I did here. Okay, so that's, that's the long sound, and that's why there's the E on the end. Because it makes it long. The short sound is just a CK. Alright, so if we look at our list, we've got our short sounds, which are kick, pack, truck, sock, sick, lock, duck, lick. Okay, we've got our long sounds, which are bike, cake, strike, duke, shake, spoke, smoke, like. So it's long, that O, oh, it's an O sound. That's why there's the E on the end. Now, we have one more special category, and it's the ones that just end with K. Okay? Um, and I'm gonna, we're gonna put the first word in there, it's gonna be book. Book. And it's two O's, and in this case, these two O's say uh, like you just got bumped. Uh. Okay, you bumped into something. You walked into a table by accident. Uh. Okay, they make an uh sound. If you hear an uh in the words, you gotta put two o's in there. Now I'll tell you a secret. Sometimes these o's make oo, but we wouldn't say book. Alright? There's no such word as book. Alright? It's a book. So so the for this week, the the double o's, the two o's is a uh. Alright? So think about that. Now I'm gonna tell you. I want you to try to write this one with the sounds you hear. Took. Took. Okay, it's going to go in this last category, I'll tell you that. Took. Okay. And they're going to look very similar. Everything with the uh in it is going to look similar. Look, I'm just changing the B to a T. I took the book. Okay, now how about the word look? How about the word look? Where's look going to go? Okay, where's look gonna go? It's gonna go right here. Look, look, look. Okay, so you can hear that uh in each of those words. And we've got two more. One of them is cook. 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 All right, that starts with a C. And then it has an ook on the end. An O, okay. Cook. And then your last word in here is shook. And that's an SH at the beginning because it's a shh sound. So it's shh. Uh. Okay, I forgot to skip a space there, but that's all right. So we've got, in this one, if you're having trouble remembering, hmm, where do these go? If you want a little rhyme to remember, you can say, look, the cook took the book and shook. Okay, or look. The cook took and shook the book. 
okay? You can, you can make up a little rhyme, kind of, to help you, a little saying to help you remember, oh, all the ook words, these stay together, <coughs> all right? You just say it in your head and get it kind of going in your head. Um, the long ones, I want you hearing for those vowel sounds. Is it an A, an E, an I, an O, a U, or a new? All right, and then the short ones are if it's not an A, an E, an I, an O, or a U. They're an A, an I, an A, uh, an A, uh, or an A. Uh. Okay, so, and if it's short, CK, long, KE. All right, otherwise, it's an OK on the end, an O-OK. Okay. All right, and you can fit other words into these patterns, too. All right, so um, that's your spelling for this week for WW. Any questions?